This video is for Colorful Sunset, page 12 and 13, from level 2A of the Technique and Artistry book. Thing I'd like you to notice is that we are introducing these two terms here, crescendo and diminuendo. And it says they are important tools for playing with expression. And as you play each crescendo and diminuendo in this piece, imagine the changing colors of the sunset. All right, so here is our crescendo mark. It lasts the whole first line. So we are supposed to start piano and get louder and louder and louder until we're actually forte on the second line. <clears throat> then we start again at measure five, piano, very quiet, get louder and louder and louder until we are forte. But this time we have a diminuendo as well, going back down to piano, okay? At measure nine, there are two things you should notice. First of all, you play your tonic chord with the left hand, then with the right hand, then your left hand, finger number two, crosses over to play high do or high G. Looks like this, left, right, high G, okay? We play that once, forte, very loud. And then it's almost like an echo because we play the same thing again, but quiet piano. Then we have one more crescendo at the end, okay? So that's all of your dynamics. Here's another thing to notice. It says to hold the damper pedal down throughout the piece. Remember the damper pedal is the one on the right side. You'll use your right foot to push that pedal down and you don't ever have to change it. You can just hold it the whole time. All right, this is a really beautiful piece and it has a beautiful duet part. I'll make a separate video for that and I hope you'll try it. Good luck with Colorful Sunset. 